All right, now it's time to go inside TMZ for all the latest from Hollywood. Joining us live on the show is Dax Holt. And Dax, we have not talked to you yet since the news broke about Kim Kardashian's divorce, so we have to catch up. First of all, we understand Kim's not happy that people are saying that her marriage is likely a sham, right? Well, I mean, I think that's the thing that most people are jumping to is the fact they're going, okay, Kim, was this really just all a big plot for your reality show? I mean, we've seen stuff crazier from Heidi and Spencer, so why not suspect the same thing from Kim Kardashian? Bring up the ratings, have this huge wedding, and then divorce when it's all done. And uh, she is ticked. She's saying that is not true, that this was all real. It was love. When they got engaged, they thought this was going to be forever, and sometimes marriages don't last. And, uh, you know, she's embarrassed and uh, sad that it's not there but unfortunately that's just the way that it's kind of played out all right and you guys have also found out what's going to happen to that infamous ring i mean that huge rock that she got for engagement so what'd you find out well, you know, everyone's going, okay, well, she's going to give back the $2 million ring to Chris. Unfortunately, he didn't buy the ring, so there's no reason for him to get it back. He never spent any money on it, um, uh, and so that, that just doesn't, it doesn't work out. And plus, I think there's also some kind of law that goes along with once you hand over the gift, mm -hmm. then it belongs to that person. Uh, and so she's going to be able to keep the ring, and, uh, you know, she can turn it into a big <laughs> necklace or something else in the future. <laughs> All right. You also found out, I guess, that Kim is partially blaming Chris's family for the breakup. She's saying they don't like her. What did you hear about that? Well, his family kind of came out and started saying how, you know, they were so saddened and they, you know, they really wanted this to work out and, they, you know, they're kind of blaming Kim for the whole thing. Well, Kim's telling all her friends that's not the truth, that the, her, his family never really liked her and that they were, they belittled her and they were nasty to her and uh, they never wanted him to get married to Kim, so she's finding it very strange and telling her friends that she just doesn't understand why they're making it seem like he's the victim now. All right. I'm sure we'll get more details from you as the days progress. Thank you, Dax. And you can catch TMZ TV right here on Fox Providence at 7 p.m. Or head to our website for information on any of the stories you just saw, Fox Providence.